このくらいの傷なら治さなくても大丈夫かな Well, if Konami is okay with it, I guess. Well, I guess it's fine. Although, then again, Yuma did say that、um, Konami cried when there was a dent in that, that、uh, Shogi bot, right? But I guess it's a sign that she has matured. But anyway, Tina also went to apologize, so. Yeah, she's here to apologize. That's the first thing you ask. <laughs> What about apologizing? Because she wants a favor from you? <laughs> If you ask me, you certainly do because you have a. You, you love Chogi very much, right? Are you sure, Konami? But what about it being a memento from your father? Tina is more important than this bot. Why? <laughs> Ah, yeah, so why? So, I never had this good crying if you just get out of your second head on that day. Oh, those are some place as a chapter. Okay, maybe that time he she was like because yeah, she damaged it right after his her dad gave it to her, but now that she has matured, maybe not as much attachment. Ah, that, that one is even a, an even bigger crack than the dad that Tina made. So, you, so, four years ago was when, probably when her father gave the bot to her. Then she made that little crack. And then two years later, she made a larger crack. <laughs> yeah. Okay, then I, then I understand now. That explains why Konami is now kind of like unfazed because she has, she has basically you know, made too many dents and cracks on the board that, you know. <laughs> yeah. So, by now, another den wouldn't make much of a difference. So that done this, ne? Dakara, correct, I know, Kizumara, Betsuni Nantomonai. At least it's still intact, you know? It's not like completely destroyed or what? So, yeah, I understand now. Dakara, so she can use it to create a kana. Actually, it's not her, it's the cat. My sister admit it. It's not your fault anyway, Tina. Yeah, she told her the truth, I guess, the cat. Yeah, and I'm surprised that Konami's room also has a TV. I mean, like, does every room have a TV? <laughs> is, is this house really so rich? <laughs> I mean, I mean, normally a normal family would have only like one TV,、uh, but it depends. I mean, in my country, I mean, it's like 
usually a family, a normal family will have only like one TV or two, two, two at best, you know. But this is like every room has a TV, and it's not just any TV, you know. It's a, it's a LCD TV, you know. Yeah, so why you feel why do you want to keep it a secret, Tina? Were you telling the truth? Don't worry, Tina, we are all good people, so you know. Oh, <laughs> Konami hugging Tina? Hey, I can be kind as well, okay? Yuma can be kind as well. <laughs> what? Oh, I see. Konami doesn't tell her to like do do you know household duties unlike what you wanted. <laughs> Seriously, that's the first thing that happens once you feel guilt. Uh, you, you, your tummy hurts. You want to thank her for that, or your tummy now having recovered? What? But I guess that works. Okay. Oh, you want her to play shogi with you? Clapping sound? <laughs> what? <laughs> well, I know that when you, when you like move the pieces, there will be a sound that you make, right? Yeah, that clapping sound, but. <laughs> but you know how to play it, Tina? Um, I mean, I mean, Konami can teach her. Yeah, says the says the one who doesn't do anything as a love fairy when it comes to love. <laughs> All right, sure. Eh? Ah, that's a bad start. Um, <laughs> Tina, do you know how to play shogi? <laughs> Seriously, Tina, what are you doing? You want to capture your own pieces? Do you want to end the key, lose your? Are you so desperate to lose? Yeah, she doesn't know. <laughs> well, I, I don't know how to play Japanese chess. I might learn it someday. Yeah, Shogi is Japanese chess. <laughs> okay. Okay. With all your rook ambition. Yeah, I mean, every version of chess has the rook version, uh, bishop version, knight version, and all that. Just that 
they are called by different names like like for example from what i know in chinese chess the king in chinese chess is actually the general yeah that sort of thing so it's just different variations yeah but uh they sort of like play the same but they don't quite play the same you know the different chess versions But of course, the main objective in all these chess versions is to capture the king, right? Yeah, that's the main objective. And then there's things like checkmate and check, yeah, exist in all versions. Yeah, as if the power of a love fairy is going to defeat uh, Konami. Okay. <laughs> okay, right? So, let's see how's. Ah, memories. Actually, I think I know how, you know, Konami's route is gonna go down. Well, besides. The thing about the incest thing, you know, uh, what's more important about this route is that we're going to learn more about Yuma's family, right, and his fa and his father, and all that. And of course, about Konami and Aoi, you know, their past and all that, basically, which is an important aspect of this story as well. I feel, yeah. <laughs> ノスタルジア。そうでしたか。私のワンだよね。はい。ママ、そう来るとはピンチです。ピンチ、イエス、ピンチ。ところで、ホナミさん。ん何ホナミさんは<笑> Uh, Tina, why is that the first question you ask? What? <laughs> yeah? Um, Tina, is that to this? You're, you're, you're asking her that question to distract. <laughs> Konami from the game, aren't you? <laughs> you trying to be funny, Tina? Yeah, that's not gonna face <laughs> uh, Konami, you know? Yeah, right back at you, Tina. Do you have someone you love? Um, when I say suki, I mean like Suki suki, dai suki, ai shiteru, love, like really love. <laughs> okay, but is that romantic love? Oh no, now you make Konami kind of sad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, then uh, now Konami realizes that, that that Suki is not the love Suki. <laughs> uh, smells really nice, okay. <laughs> Uh, that's kind of an awkward question. Well, as a maybe brother sister, but that may change soon. As much as the ch night piece, <laughs> that's how precious the night is. Mm. It would be cool if I can actually see them playing on the spot like the bot, you know, but 
Yeah, it's understandable. But when Tina asks that question, she probably just means it as like like rather than love, you know? Uh, okay. Okay, sure, Tina. <laughs> Makes no sense to me, though, Tina. <laughs> that's why that's why Konami is a shogi expert. Kichikuri? Um I don't think brute is the right word to use here, but anyway, maybe like quite ruthless, yeah. I mean although I think the word ruthless was used earlier. So maybe an alternative for the word ruthless, but definitely wouldn't use the word brute. You know, that's not really the right word to use here. Well, I don't know how easier she's gonna go though. <laughs> Alright. Um, another random question. Yeah, I mean, Tina... <laughs> I, uh, <laughs> I'm not even gonna say it. <laughs> what are you gonna do, Tina, though? <laughs> I mean, I never s saw you did anything in Aunt's route, so... <laughs> anyway, <laughs> yeah, I'm not gonna... I mean, in the common room, she also didn't really do anything, so... <laughs> but anyway, alright, now we're back in Yunma's perspective. Having finished dinner, which was somewhat late due to Aoi-san's late return from work, it's now almost time for bed. <coughs> oh, Konami. Yeah, the door's open. Oh man, <laughs> Tina. Uh, I mean, Konami. <laughs> She really likes to wear quite flimsy like this, right? But that's what makes her cute, you know. <laughs> I always like her, like her like this. <laughs> yeah, I mean, and, and you know, you must used to it. So, okay. Anyway, yeah. What about Tina-san? She seemed to be in a great in a great mood during dinner. Did you forgive her? Okay. Is that so? Yeah, she explained the whole situation. Ah, then she should have just said so from the beginning. I swear she can be so awkward. Do I? Oh yeah, but then again, Yuma's face is always looks, always looks grim, right? I don't think I did. You you don't know. That's the thing, Yuma. You don't even know that yes. You're smiling like quite awfully and all that. You don't even know that your smile is good. <laughs> Probably. Yeah, sure. I would. I was never going to chide her for it in the first place. I just wanted to tell her that it's wrong to hide it. <laughs> okay. Despite that, I have, I had an angry look on my face. Well, yeah, that's true, yeah. Well, 
On a conscious level, I didn't particularly have that in mind. But maybe she's right with that. Ah, <laughs> Konami, please don't tease me like that, <laughs> okay? What are you saying? <laughs> <laughs> uh, please don't tease me like that, Konami. I'm at a bit of a loss as to how to react. <laughs> don't read my mind. Ah, that kind of love. Yeah, you know. Family love, sort of, yeah. <laughs> I'm telling you, don't read my mind. As a as a brother, right? Yeah, sibling love, yeah. Yeah, I love you as well. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I will. Since it's my beloved sister's request, I'll fulfill it. Alright, good night, Konami. Yeah, good night. Well then. In order to respond to my sister's request, I have to make sure I wake up in time tomorrow. Okay. Then we have to wake her up again. Is she gonna like undress herself again? I don't know. <laughs> Okay, Tuesday, April 23rd. When I throw a glance at my, walk, at my clock with my head still fuzzy, I find that I have just 5 minutes left before the alarm rings. Oh, that's early riser. Surprisingly, I woke up pretty easily to today, in sharp contrast to yesterday. I'm not really sleepy, so I guess I'll just get up. I operate my cell phone and turn off the alarm before it goes off. Well then. And what exactly are you two up to? Who? Uh, Tina and, and Konami? Alright, it's Tina and Kotaro. And what, what are the two of you doing here again? Hey, you're not... Can you be patient? Your route will come right at the end. <laughs> I don't know whether Aoi-san asked her to wake me up again or not. Or what? But Tina is standing right next to my bed. Come to think of it, both of you are always up pretty early. Okay, sure. <laughs> Though I also get a feeling in your case, you could say you actually sleep more than is good for you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh yeah, I've actually yet to see Tina sleeping. How how does she actually sleep? She sleeps with Aoi, right? So she so I thought she would be use a normal pillow, but she actually uses Kotaro as a pillow. You do that? Well, fluffy, I guess. <laughs> Insights. With his appearance, I can only imagine Cotton flying out. Do you actually sleep in the first place? Okay, sure. Since you claim to be Tina's familiar, I thought you were watching her surroundings 24-7. But apparently I was wrong. But I, uh, even if he's sleeping, I'm sure if there's any danger, looming danger, I'm sure... Well, I'm sure uh, Kotaro should be able to sense it, so... Yeah. In a way, you're even more free feeling than Tina. His words make you ponder what purpose a familiar serves. Wait, wait, what about Konami? I have to wake up Konami first. 
ございますけど。Yeah. Yeah, got it. I'll come right after waking Konami up. You can go on ahead. はい、お待ちしてます。Seemingly relieved, Tina heads towards the door. Oh, yeah, Tina? I'm sorry about yesterday. I heard everything from Konami before I went to sleep. Yeah, you forgot to tell me, but it's okay. How could you forget something like that? Seriously, Tina. So it's you who's gonna make my love with、um, Konami come true, <laughs> even though it's sort of wrong in the first place. Actually, it's wrong. It's not sort of wrong, but huh? What does that have to do with your love fairy powers? Just say breakfast, okay? You're hungry, okay? <laughs> Sh sure. I had no idea what that was about. Well, I guess it doesn't matter. For now, I should get changed and go wake up Konami. Oh, in Tina's perspective. Why exactly do you want to do that, though? Um, <laughs> hey, hey, Tina, you should be the one doing the job. You're the love fairy. Why are you strangling Kotaro now? <laughs> Did he say thing together? So this ne. To be honest, until tomorrow, I will think about it. I want to know. Oh my God! Do you know what? Why are you forcing him to tell you everything, Tina? What? What are you doing? Date, well, I guess that's a start, yes. I have a bad feeling Tina's going to screw it up though, but somehow things are going to work. <laughs> I don't know. 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 I don't But you have no idea what date is, right, Tina? So <laughs> I don't know how, what's gonna happen. Yeah, yeah, it spared me some trouble since she got up properly today. <laughs> yeah, I mean, <laughs> that was really funny. Yeah, 
帰る頃にはすっかり乾いてました。You washed your socks at school? ちゃんと洗濯ばさみで止めたから大丈夫だったよ。Where do you hang them though? <laughs> And just where did you get the clothes pin? From? なおさんに借りた。なお ?Okay. Ah, I see. Well, she's a nurse, so she has to be prepared for everything.、Uh, that's not it. She just filled up the infirmary with her personal things, to the extent that she might as well live there. Well, I mean, the way she dressed also is like she's, she's at home. <laughs> so, and nobody says anything about that. So, however, there are times when she also has to wash the room's soft furnishings or the clothes of a student who got dirty. So, clothes pins. Actually, come in handy at work. <laughs> well, she is, yeah. Well, you are quite different from your usual self. Oh man, I didn't say that, but okay. When did I say that? <laughs> Don't say that as if you've seen through my thoughts. You can say that she's cute if you see her in that state for the first time. But in my case, I am confronted with a half asleep Konami every day, so I find it hard to assess her as such. Why do you want to see me half asleep? <laughs> you can complain all you want about it, but you never get to see that. Yeah, never. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> What hypertension? What? No, I have no such thing. What are you saying all of a sudden? What does lack of sleep have anything to do with hypertension, though? Maybe there is, but it doesn't immediately lead to hypertension or what? To begin, in, to begin with, I think you'll hardly find anyone worrying about blood pressure at such a young age. I won't know for sure what blood pressure I actually have until I get my results of the health checkup we had some time ago. But getting up has been easy for me for as long as I can remember. Um, Konami, <laughs> what? Actually, it's the opposite. My blood pressure has always been rather low. Yeah, I mean, hypertension is not something seen commonly in young. Don't make it a hereditary issue. Dad also had no problems getting up, you know? What? What? <laughs> Konami? Just because you're different doesn't mean I, I, we found you under the bridge or what? Yes. Oh my god, this is so. <laughs> Konami, what? We are genuinely blood related siblings, I'm afraid.、Mm, Konami really loves to be sarcastic, doesn't she? <laughs> Considering how well you know us since you're our childhood friend, how could that honestly startle you? Oh my god. Don't, don't tell me anything about that, Mio. <laughs> don't tell me. That means. And at the same time, I'm having this bad premonition. Konami says. Yes, yes, I know you're not okay. <laughs> Mio, I know about all about your fetishes. Because that's the kind of stuff you read. Uh, uh, 
no, 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 I don't like Yaoi, so no. Uh, uh. <laughs> Bye. As we all begin to explanation, Konami and I increase our pace. Bye! <laughs> the weather is pretty nice today, yeah! You know, so beautiful! Wow! <laughs> Having this sort of harmonious conversation, we make our way to school. With Mio's deplorable voice as our BGM. <laughs> BGM? Okay. But seriously, taking care of the flowers is pretty tough. Okay, um, I just want to say something before we continue. So far, Konami's route isn't exactly that interesting, interesting to me so far, but I guess we have to be patient because Konami's route kind of start off, kind of starts off pretty slow. Unlike, uh, unlike what? Unlike, uh, yeah, unlike Ant's route. Yeah, because uh, because answer is something pretty interesting because of the story and also you know yeah her, her other side right which is uh, <coughs> which is yeah Ellie Eleonora but Konami's route so far is kind of a slow start but I think things might change later yeah down the road I hope so so yeah. I have faith in those who you know, recommended me to play Konami's route next, so alright. After school, having finished maintenance on not only the flower bit at the courtyard, but also the one at the back of the school building, Mio and I are walking down the hallway. Each type of flower has to be maintained differently, right? Yeah, we know that Mio likes to tend to the flowers, right? It's fun, huh? Well, de depends on taste. I mean, I'm not a fan of watering plants, so... Right now, I'm still so desperate about doing everything right that I can't even tell. To be honest, I'm not proficient enough to understand the joy of taking care of flowers. Me too. I have my hands full just following Mio's instructions. Really? If that's the case, it's surely because you're good at teaching me. So, so <laughs> oh, now you're embarrassing Mio. Actually, I'm only able to properly do my work because Mio is there. Oh, hey, Yuri. <laughs> Yo, Tsukishima. You done with your work as well? Yeah, and also the one at the back of the school building. Actually, didn't Aunt mention like, mm, there's, there isn't a flower bit at the back of the school building, right? So, uh, or maybe there actually is, but mm, uh, I'm not sure. But yeah, I remember Aunt's route saying that there's only a flower bit at the courtyard, which is the, where the fountain is, but there isn't a... A flower bed at the at the back of the school building, right? Is there? I know there are a lot of weeds there, though. But okay. Well, anyway. Maybe there actually is, but oh well. Hey, what's so funny? You underestimate. You're underestimating my abilities to do gardening? <laughs> it's not like it's my first time today. <laughs> it doesn't mean gardening is girly. Gardening doesn't have to be a girly thing. <laughs> so 
If Flower Master Mio says so, then there's no room for doubt. Rather than carefully, I feel like Timmy Lee would be the more fitting adverb to describe how I dealt with the flowers. But I guess I shouldn't put away her praise by saying that. Do I really look so incapable of flower maintenance? Well, it's more like they think it's girly, most likely. By the way, what have you been doing? Isn't that kind of tough all by yourself? Respect, you have my respect Yuri, that's why I'm definitely going to play Yuri as my next fruit after Konami. <laughs> right, now that you mention it, I tend to forget about that since she's basically the only PMC member who comes to the student council room, which invites me to believe she's doing all the work by herself. Yeah, you better you know continue your work if you're not if we aren't like bothering you or something. Oh, you want to help Yuri? Okay, then I'll join in. In that case, I'll lend you a hand as well. Oh, okay, sure. I guess you have a point. Alright, leave Senpai to me. Okay. Iterashai. Yeah, do your best. After seeing the two of them off, I return to the student council room. Tadaima. Yeah, we haven't talked to An for quite a while, right? So, alright. Uh, oh, Konami was wrong. Uh, is An here? As I enter the room, I see Senpai and Konami facing each other with a shogi bot between them. Okay, An's here playing shogi with Konami. It seems they're in the middle of a match. Uh, we parted on the way here since she's going to help Tsukishima. <laughs> um, no, Yuri said she'll be fine with Mio alone. Of course, I offered her my help, but she told me that Mio's help was enough for her and I should go help you instead. Okay. Yeah, I agree. Yeah, this is one thing I like about An, you know, her personality. But judging by this situation, I guess student council work is already over. Yeah, we know why An's an expert at Shogi, right? Yeah, from her root. Probably because her opponent is Senpai, Konami is completely focusing on the board. She might not have him. She might not have even noticed them here. Oh, what, what happened? In contrast to Konami, you sure are quite composed, aren't you? I don't think that has anything to do with it, but I guess I would only waste my breath if I remark that. So, do we still have anything else to do today? I see. Okay then. Having said that, uh, I sit down to watch their match. Well, yeah, I have nothing better to do. I can't afford to miss the moment my precious sister prevails over her arch enemy after all. Oh, yeah, that's that too. Well, I mean, on the side of my sister. <laughs> oh? Wasn't that a pretty good move just now? Okay. 
Looking at the state of the board, it seems like Konami is one-sidedly on the attack, but Senpai is actually the one who clearly displays more mental composure when making her moves. The fact that Konami's face is showing signs of nervousness and impatience, something I rarely see whenever she plays against me, serves to prove that. Well, we can't really see what exactly is going on with the shogi pot, but at least we can see the intensity, right? And I think this music... Have I heard this music before? I think I did, probably in Unsroot. Yeah, but this is intense music. Senpai places a rook right into an obvious trap which Konami had set up. Yeah, but yeah, I've heard of this music before. That's odd. Someone as skilled as her should have definitely realized that. Could it be that she has something up her sleeve? You're up against a master, a chess master, Konami. You have to do even you have to do make a lot of effort to beat her. It seems the same thought passes through Konami's mind. Normally, you would now capture the rook that fell for the trap. Well then, what is she going to do? Ah, in response to Senpai's incomprehensible move, Konami cautiously retreats without capturing Senpai's rook, taking precautions. Ah. Driving into the promotion zone, Senpai's rook becomes a Dragon King. Dragon King. Could it be her move just now was a fake? Was that a bluff? <laughs> Senpai laughs merrily. Yeah, this Sasuga chess master. Shogi master. Just as I figured, she's completely losing to her psychologically. That's unexpected. Whenever she plays against me, she seems to have a lot more fun. Uh, this is serious mode though. Right now, Konami appears really straight. I want to help her calm down somehow. As that thought passes through my mind, I, un I unconsciously place my hand on Konami's hand. <laughs> you only realize I'm here? You only just realize that? While her expression is tinged with astonishment, I can also see signs of relief mixed into it. Will my words be able to help her? What's the matter? You're all tensed up. Yeah. Come on, relax your shoulders. I know you can win this. Hey, you're already an expert. I don't need I don't need to take your hand. I'm sorry, but I'm rooting for my sister. So I can't support the villain. <laughs> the enemy. <laughs> oh, Dragon is hers. Dragon is Konami's. Yeah, because of me. I'm the powerhouse now. <laughs> That's what I would expect from Konami. It seems she already figured out how to counter this situation. It's just that she lacked the courage to implement it. Yeah, thanks to me, yeah. I'm the one who will conquer... Uh, An. <laughs> I haven't done anything. It's your own skill. That's right, Konami's skill is higher than this. So all I did was keep her light push in the pack. <laughs> oh, both of them serious mode, really serious mode. Uh, yeah, that's more like the Konami I know. Give it your best, Konami. Alright. Well, in the end, it's just too much for Konami. I mean, I'm not surprised since I played Unsroot, so yeah. <laughs> but, but, you could try, Konami. You did your best. But it took like the 
her whole afternoon or something like that because it's really evening. Well, she did rally again. The repercussions of that one move where she retreated still led to Konami having to chalk this game up to a loss in the end. Yeah, I saw it all. What? What are you giving me? Huh? Why are you holding out your hand? I'm not going on a date with you or what? What? Why should I do that though? <laughs> What's this girl saying all of a sudden? Let me just ask out of curiosity. Why? I never said that. <laughs> I promised no such thing. She's my sister. <laughs> I really cheered her on. Well, holding her hand in itself isn't really an issue, but I really don't feel like pleasing her even more, seeing how happy she is about winning. <laughs> I don't apologize. I mean, one thing is that it's just a game, and secondly, you did your best. Hmm? About what? No, 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 it's okay, it's fine, girl. Well, no need to worry about that. Just give it your best again next time, okay? Yeah. This is what you call bro power. <laughs> Sibling power. Is that so? Explosively, huh? Good to know. You make it sound as if I was actually better than you. I'm just playing by intuition. So it's not like I could do anything about it even if she complained. Oh, what reward is that? Is he a plushie or something? <laughs> huh? Senpai Rami just threw the pockets of her exclusive school uniform, what? Oh, her you oh her school uniform. Oh, what is it? Oh, a ticket to wait. Is it a ticket to go somewhere that the two of us can go together or something like that? Like you know what you call a date to? Well, seriously, a free admission ticket for up to two people? That's that's so cool. That's so convenient. <laughs> yeah, just for the two of us, Konami and Yuma. Flower Park? Where is that Flower Park? Oh, that that actually works perfectly because just now we were. Yuma was just talking to me about the about gardening, right? So that's the perfect perfect place to go to. Alright, now that you mentioned it, I remember seeing a commercial with relaxing background music for it. No, don't throw it away. Go with me. Come on, Konami, go with me. <laughs> I think that would be a waste. Putting aside whether you go or not, why don't you just accept it for now? Yeah, why not? I'll go with you. <laughs> you think I am? You see? <laughs> Konami is smart. Yeah, I do flower maintenance. That's why. Right. It all comes down to it. It's all linked. I'm doing that because it's work. Mio or Aoi-san might be interested though. But I would really want to go with Konami though. <laughs> Just because it's a route. 
高校に使ったり気になる男子を誘ったり有効活用してねはい頑張ります While the former is very likely, the latter seems to be possible, which actually makes me feel a bit worried about her. Yeah, asking out a guy because the only guy is me. <laughs> Anyways, I know there's no point in asking this now, but couldn't you have gone without waiting until it's about to expire? Last month. The board chairman? Oh, yeah, Senpai is supposed to supposedly close with the board chairman. Oh, as in the the, the chairman, board chairman, as in the teacher? Principal, something like that? Hmm. Okay. That's quite a harsh remark considering you're talking about the board chairman. I don't know what kind of person he is, but the fact is, he's the most powerful person in Mihaya Academy. Okay, she's so he's the you know, like the principal, yeah, the chairman of the school. So Konami, what are you going to do with the ticket? Okay, I see. <laughs> well, to, well, this isn't Mio's route though. <laughs> Don't act all considerate in the wrong way. <laughs> That's not the point. Yes, says the one who I later who I fell in love with <laughs> in her route. I know that. And also, Senpai, don't just arrive at weird conclusions by yourself. Oh, just when the thought that she's acting almost like a certain love fairy goes through my mind, the door to the room opens. Oh, welcome back. Oh, Mio, you have that. Yeah, the the DMC, yeah, the Discipline Committee banner. Ban, ban, I mean, not banner, ban. The two girls wearing PMC armbands return. Yeah, PMC. Oh, what? Then the face of a familiar guy also appears behind them. Oh, is it so? Where have you been, so though? You lazy bastard. Ah, I saw. Oh, <laughs> I looks disappointed. Okay. Uh, <laughs> okay. Come to think of it, your locker is also strangely orderly. Alright, time to go home. Otsukaresama de sta. Come on, let's go home, so. Okay, sorry for calling you a lazy bastard. <laughs> ah, so you weren't here today because you had supplementary classes. Why did you do bad on that physics test? <laughs> uh, this is Mihayama. I, I mean, this is Mihaya Academy's vice president. Ha, huh, the slacker. <laughs> uh, try your best, vice president. Well, <laughs> yeah. Completely ignoring Soul's question, I leave the student council room. Right. 